Okay, so uh, today I'm going to show you how to convert your VR chat avatar to Chillout's VR uh, SDK. So you can upload your VR chat avatar that you've already set up to Chillout uh, very easily, actually. Um, so what you need to do, first of all, is import Chillout's SDK. And you need to import a tool so you can convert all of those fizz bones back to dynamic bones. So um, there's a tool made by Dread and he has one fizz bone converter. I will leave a link in the description. And you also need peanut tools, which will also be in the description, which converts your avatar automatically for you, which is a super, super handy. So um, import all those tools and then uh, follow along with uh, the tutorial. So I'm gonna assume you have all of those imported. So the first thing you wanna do is go to your actions layer and go to this here, wait for action RFK. You need to get rid of the uh, animation here. So just click that and click none. And also you will need uh, VR Labs, Avatar Tree Manager, and then you just drag your turn there and you need to turn on uh, right default. So that's the easiest way to do it with uh, Avatar Tree Manager. Um, so it puts an empty clip in there then as well. So that's kind of handy. Um, now, the next thing you want to do is convert all those fizz bones to um, to uh, dynamic bones. So what we're going to do here is just going to duplicate the original model. So that way we have a, uh, a backup, you know, for uh, VR chat on, the, on upload there as well. So um, we'll call this, um, I'm just going to call it box chill out. So now you want to go to the tool made by Dread, go to Fizzbone Converter, and you want to drag your model in there, your avatar, and then simply just hit convert. And that is it converted. It has all dynamic bones now, which is all good. Um, now the next thing you want to do is use the peanut tool, which is here. Again, drag your avatar in there and hit convert. And that is it converted. So, oh, it actually creates a uh, backup for you. Okay. Um, so you want to make sure your uh, voice is coming from your mouth, which, you know, makes sense. And then your view position is... There, I'm just gonna put mine around there. That should be fine. And then all you gotta do is upload to uh, chill out. So you wanna log in with your details. Um, and uh, let me just make this window bigger. Um, yeah, but also I will say the uh, SDK for VR chat is um, what is the current version? Uh, this is the version that's been tested with on uh, on the tools that uh, I said to import. Um, I haven't. There's one version that's uh, out now that's slightly ahead of this, but um, if you're on this version, it works fine. Uh, I haven't tested it with the latest version, um, but it should work fine as well. Um, yeah, so we want to upload to um, chill out. So all you got to do uh, has the right one there. Chill out VR, lovely jubbly, and hit upload avatar. <coughs> and then once you get to this screen here, you make sure to tag or add the tags if your avatar has any of these loud audio, loud range audio, music, spawn audio, and etc. So have a look through them and make sure to tag them. 
um because if you don't your avatar may get um deleted um but um yeah you'll see why um so you click the next step and then you want to do a picture and just like vr chat it has if you go back to the scene um you can click this shot cam cvr so you just want to want to move that over you know a bit um just like so and uh position it where uh where you uh where you want you know um and then just uh hit upload when you're oh wait, no sorry my bad my bad then you want to write a name for it so we'll just call it tut fox we'll call it nice and simple um and uh yeah if you're uploading it then you can add a change log if you want and then you hit continue the next step and then you hereby clarify that you upload content belongs to you blah 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 and here's the bit about the tags hereby clarify the tags are correctly and fit uploaded content um so you just check those and continue your next step and then it begins uploading and it doesn't, shouldn't take that long at all it's actually pretty pretty fast compared to uh vr chat sometimes And there we go. Message from server upload complete. Your content is now available in game. So now you can launch up the game and your avatar will be there for you to use. So thanks for watching. Um, if you have any problems, uh, leave a comment down below. And also don't forget to give your video a like if this helped you out. And consider subscribing for more uh, Unity tutorials. Thanks for watching. And peace.